back with the Project Pan Roulette update number five, I believe. April 5. <laughs> okay, so let's get started because these are always a little bit longer. So my first one is my most recent purchase, which is the Modern Renaissance palette. I have used this a few times this month. And here is my update. Trying to get any of these to pan. And it looks like it could be this one or this one. They are the most used. I don't know if you can tell the depths or not. All right. Next one is my favorite foundation, and I have the Infallible Pro Glow, which I cannot remember for the life of me if I use this month. I think I did once, and but I have not. Let me look here. It feels like it is down a little bit farther this time. I could never remember where I put my pen, so it does look like I've gone down a little bit. It's going to be hard to see, though. I actually marked down by the, you can see that little bit darker spot. So I have used a little bit of that. All right, my next one is full-size product, and that is the Torina Tarantino's Doll Skin Cheek Palette. And I've used this once, I believe, this month is all. And I'm, I'm going for this top one here. So I don't know if you can tell any difference there or not. Okay, next is my favorite product from Category of Your Choice. And I chose my Milani Rose Blush and Tea Rose. And I've used this quite a bit this month, actually. So I don't know if you how much you can tell there from the last picture, but I will post both. Product that smells good, chocolate bar palette, and I've used this a few times this month also. And we are going for any pan on this one also. And I am assuming it's probably going to be this one here, or this one maybe. Because though that's my transition that I usually use, and this is my base. So let's see if there's any dips in there. All right. Product you bought at Walgreens. Well, that would be my Wet n Wild Trio Eyeshadow Walking on Eggshells. I've used this a couple of times this month. This is what it looks like. Got something on the cover there. There. This is my favorite. Like I've said in several videos, this is my favorite um, eyeshadow from Walking or um, from Wet n Wild besides their Comfort Zone. I absolutely love this one. And I used all three quite a bit this month, or, you know, a couple of times this month anyway. All right, product you bought online was the Becca Highlighter in Opal. And I've also used this a couple of times. Getting very close there. Product you received as a gift, and that would be the Benefit Your Real Big Sexy Lips in Lush Rose. And I did use this just this last week. I think that's once or twice I've used that this month. And... There we go with that. Uh, 
Um, current favorite product, Ulta Eye Primer. And I need to mark this. And I've only gone up, God, I use this every day, and I've only gone up just a tiny bit. There is the newest mark on there. Almost gone. Um, product you aren't sure you like yet, and that would be the Clinique Even Better Foundation. And I have not used this this month. I'm having a hard time using this. And I shouldn't be because it's a good foundation. Um, product in pencil form, which I just dropped, would be the Jordana Easy Liner in Rock and Rose. That's the Easy Liner. And I do not have much left of this. Not much at all. That'll last me a few more weeks, I'm guessing. Matte product, Milani Matte Naked Lipstick. And I have used this once or twice this month. A metallic product, Wet n Wild Metallic Lipstick and Peony well, Express. I'll have to find that one later because I don't know where it's at. But I did use it a couple of times this month. Product you didn't purchase yet you want to. Tart Tardiest Mascara. There it's my lipstick. It was hiding. And it's so hard. I know I used this a few times this month, but it's so hard to tell where you're at in here. I think I'm just below my other line is where I can see it. So I just moved that line down just a little bit. All right, the Tardiest Mascara. Put it away. Um, as all of you know, the now, I changed my mind a bit on the formula. The formula I'm really liking a lot, but it is the packaging I hate. So I would consider buying this again, but I'm not real sure. Anyway, I did use this for a whole week this this um, time, this month. All right, almost done here. Um, close your eyes and pick a lip product. I went with the Too Faced Lip to Stick in Nude Beach. I should have took everything out of here. And I'm not finding that lipstick either. Yep, right here it is. <laughs> I keep putting them away instead of putting them where they belong. And I use this once, I think, this month. All right, a face primer, L'Oreal Magic Lumi. I keep forgetting to use this. I have not used this at all this month. And a makeup remover, which um, I'm going to mark off because I can't find it. So next time I'll choose another something. I don't know what. But anyway, that is my update for the month. Um, I hope you're all doing well. And if you like this kind of stuff, please give me a thumbs up. And please check out the videos from the ladies below. And I'll talk to you very soon.